Hey, it's me, GV, and welcome to another boss guide for none other than the Ghost Fire Dragon, or the Ghost Flame Dragon, one of the two. In Elden Ring, ladies and gentlemen, this guy's a little north in a lake of the starting area. Uh, nothing too difficult, he is your standard Drake. You know, yeah, you probably fought this type of enemy a million times. Um, but yeah, he's got some interesting stuff, he's got faster slams. Really fast slams. And he's got kind of a different fire pattern uh, with his ghost flame. So, a little tricky. Uh, we are using the Dragon Hunter Katana. And there, there's, let me tell you this. There's a lot of dragons in this DLC. More than I was expecting. A lot of dragons. So, this Dragon Slayer Katana is, uh, yeah. I think it deals extra damage to dragons. Plus, it has bleed. Plus, it has a sick Ash of War. So, here we go. It's the Ghost Flame Dragon. So yeah, with this katana, you can kind of do that, which is nice, although that missed. Roll! Alright, so see, that comes out super fast. So you gotta roll that faster than your typical... Alright, he also does this spread. You gotta kind of roll delayed. You wanna wait to roll for that, uh... Ghost Flame spread. And then obviously, just as usual, wail into him as much as you can. Just keep in mind, those wings come out so quick. He is a fast, fast, fast boy. And, uh, yeah, I'm not sure if he can bleed. I wouldn't be surprised if he could not bleed, because considering he is a, um, you know, he's a, a bony boy. But if you have the Dragon Slayer Katana or a Sick Ash of War, you can obviously use it to do this sort of thing, which is really nice. Uh, if he does that, keep it by him. He's probably going to do another blast below him, which he did right there. We got caught by the tail end. Let's heal. One, two, woo, three. Okay, no big deal. Get him once there. Where's he at? Oh, I had to blind roll that. That's that typical hover in the air and then slam move. A lot of the drakes have that. Okay, what's he doing? Roll. Yeah, roll into him and roll into him fast. When he does the slams. Okay, what's he gonna do? Tail whip, but he's got a little bony tail, so the tail whip's a little bit easier to deal with. Uh, when this happens, he's about to do a big AoE, so get your butt out of there. We're gonna hit him with another L2. Blah, blah, blah. Roll. Roll. Okay, let's try to hit him here. Alright, what's he doing? He's gonna move backwards. Okay, rolled that a little early, but luckily we did not get hit. Okay, tail whip. I'm gonna heal my FP here. What you got going on? Roll. Yeah, as long as you roll towards him, you'll be relatively okay. You gotta just look out for that tail whip animation that he does. Alright. Uh, this guy, when he slams with his feet, he will deal a big AoE as well. So keep that in mind. Roll. Okay, gonna hit his head there. He's gonna miss last second. Let's hit his feet a couple more times. Alright, what you got, big boy? What you doing? Roll! Uh, this time that by a split second. Okay, so he's going to slam with the ghost fire. So if you see him slam with his feet, run the fire out if you can. Let's try to go for his head here with one of these. Beautiful. Okay, we're going to get under his head here. Unfortunately, got caught. Let's heal twice. Okay, we're just watching to see what he does. Roll. Nice, yeah. Animation is so fast, it's crazy. Let's do a charge dart too. Beautiful. We're going to slam with his foot. Unfortunately, we got caught by the ghost fire. Alright, we're gonna highlight his head again and do one of these. Bam! Roll. Nice. Find his feet. Try to outrun the fire. Good. Okay, charge dart two. Not gonna land. What's he gonna do? What's he gonna do? Gonna go for a jumping attack on his foot, I think. There we go. He's doing some ghost fire stuff. But forward, so we are fine. We're gonna outrun the ghost fire. From his foot. Jumping R2. Beautiful. He's gonna move over there. Ah! Yeah, that's really hard to time because it comes out so fast. Woo! Just by the hair of our chinny chin chin on that one. Okay, let's do another one of these. And he's one shot. Roll that. And. Down goes the ghost flame dragon. Uh, so yeah, nothing too crazy with this guy. 
Dragon Heart, and the Somber Ancient Dragon Smithing Stone, which is good for new DLC weapons. Uh, nothing crazy with this guy. Um, he just has faster attack animations than most Drakes, so you got to get the timing down, roll a little bit faster than you normally would. Uh, and the Ghost Flame has a kind of weird pattern when he does the slow one. You kind of have to wait and roll through the delayed blast twice. Uh, and then just keep in mind, if he does the forward fire, he'll usually do it right under him afterwards. And then if he does a foot slam, it'll also do an AoE Ghost Flame. And yeah, he's got that big lunging bite, but that's pretty easy to roll into. And I think that's about it. Standard Drake fight for the most part. Um, definitely recommend this weapon because a lot of dragons in this DLC. A lot of dragons. So uh, Dragon Hunter's Great Katana. Pretty good. But hope that guide helped. Thanks so much for watching. Check out the links in the description below if you'd like to support. And I'll see you next time. Bye.